Hi, welcome back. Now we are going to see how to create the Oracle user or uh, any user in the Oracle 12c architecture. As we know, Oracle 12c is a multi-tenant architecture where we can have a container database and inside the container database we can have a multiple pluggable databases. But when we talk about the Oracle or uh, user creation, so this user creation is quite different uh, as compared to the Oracle 11G architecture or till 11G ar architecture. So uh, we are going to see this thing in a practical way as well. So in our Oracle 12C, we have a two kind of user. The first one is a common user and the second is a local user. Now let us try to understand what is meant by common user. As we know, we have a multi-tenant architecture. So let us try to understand that this is a root container database. And in root container database, we can have our multiple pluggable databases. So this is our PDB1, pluggable database 1. And this is the PDB2. And this is our container database. So inside the container database, we have a multiple pluggable database. Now, whenever we are going to create the user, we need to understand where this user is going to create, whether this user is going to create inside the container database or this is a part of pluggable databases or pluggable database too. So because of that only, they have come up with the situation, a common user and the local user. Generally, while working on the Oracle database administration, we will never create the user in uh, common as a, uh, we will we will not uh, try to create the user as a common user so common user means which is created inside the container databases and the local user means which is a part of pluggable database it can be a part of pluggable database 1 or it can be a part of pluggable database 2 so as we know this pluggable database are already connected with a different kind of application so we need to make sure that this user are different and are not, you know, uh, as this is a security part, we need to understand that the user which we are creating here, it should not be available here itself. So that is the one thing that we need to take care. If I'm creating the user here, it should be the part of PDB1 only. It should not be the part of PDB2. So this is called a local user. So first of all, we need to connect to the pluggable database here and then we are going to create the user in PDB1. If I want to create the pluggable database in PDB2, first of all, we will connect our session to the PDB2 and then we are going to create the user here itself. So this uh, user will be, you know, uh, different as a part of PDB1 and PDB2. Now we have a common user also. But when we are creating the common user, we need to mention the prefix as C hash hash. If you are directly going and trying to create the username as create user username identified by password, it will not allow you. So before that, we need to mention the C hash hash as a prefix. And here you can put the username. We are going to see this thing in a practical way. So no need to worry. So this is the databases Oracle 12C and I'm trying to connect to the Oracle 12C database SQL plus slash as a CGBA. I have connected to the 12C Oracle databases and now we are going to create the user as you uh, create user username uh, maybe test user identified by test user. Here you can see I am directly trying to connect to the user inside the container database. But we are getting the error message saying invalid common user or role name. So as I said earlier, we need to create the user by using the prefix C hash hash. This is called a common user, which is a common for all container and pluggable databases. Now it has created the user but this is a common user make sure you are uh, understanding the things that this is a common user this is not a local user now 
we are going to see how to create the user in a locally but before that i will just grant some privileges grant create session to c hash hash test user so that this user can connect to the container database now i am going to create the local user in order to create the local user first of all we need to check what are all the pdbs we have so this is the command show pdbs here you can see we have a two pluggable database the first one which is always a seed pluggable database and it will always open in a read only mode and uh, alter session set container equals to pdb db1 so i am trying to connect to the our pluggable database pdb db1 and here i can create the user as as like our normal user create user username as test local local user identified by local so i have created a local user which is a local user for the pdb db1 we can we can have let's say we i have a multiple pluggable database here so i can use the same username in a different pluggable database but not in a single pluggable database because these two users are uh, the the users which are from pluggable database one and pluggable database two are completely different this is a complete different architecture so we can have a same username but it should be available in different pluggable database and i will just try to grant some privileges grant create session to local underscore user so that this user can connect to the pluggable database so this is done now we are just trying to connect by using this local user sql plus uh, our local user is local underscore user and the password for local is local only and this is how show connection underscore name i have connected to the pdb db1 show user local underscore user this is how we can connect by using our local user to the pluggable database directly and this is the way to create the local user and the common user in the oracle 12c architecture thank you so much